Most people in America Im imply that when they throw something away in the trash, generally speaking, it stays in the trash. It becomes somewhat public access for a very short period of time, meaning that the person who threw it away could at that same day or next day go, oh shit, I made a mistake and something slipped into the trash, or maybe my friend threw this away and they didn't mean it, and they'll go get it. But beyond that, it is a collector's paradise, not at all, that people you do know who are impoverished and are not impoverished go into the trash. What I am telling you, however, is I am not professing the name of illegal activity. I am communicating the reporting of a life of a man that is being constantly abused by a little fucking garbage truck company that is prolificated with Hispanics. And I am fucking pissed off. So let me explain to you this shirt. This shirt used to fit me when I was 16 inches wider around. So it should be pretty fucking big on me. Now what I'm finding is that my shirt is shortened by the collar and that the collar is not the same size and a lot thinner around me. I don't appreciate that. I have photographs of me in it when I was bigger around. So let me explain something to you. Stop entering my bags. Stop entering my property room. Stop entering my storage and adjusting my clothing. This was happening to me when I was in Noblesville, Indiana, and it's now happening to me again, probably by the garbage company, Atlantic Services, Inc., and their people, because who else is getting into the trash cans where I'm throwing things away? Out here at the mall, anyway. Because it was happening still on the campus. So was it the ABC service company doing it, or is it totally immoral, mentally unwell, female person, God knows what persuasion that keeps accosting my property?